Greg, another 4-1 win in pre-season this time over at Newcastle. United 11 here at the National Stadium. First off, how do you reflect on that game? Yeah, um, again, it's pre-season, so um, we'll not take too much away from it, apart from we've still won the game again. Um, another good performance and more minutes in our legs. So, um, all in all, it's another good Saturday. Um, with now one game left to go before the season starts, so good day out. You say, obviously, like you say, it's, it's pre-season, so at the end of the day, the results aren't <laughs> counting towards anything, but how is it helping in, in terms of your confidence that especially going forward, you're putting a fair few goals past whoever's put in front of you at the minute? Mm. Uh, I think that's 25 now, is it, for pre-season? So, I mean, going on years, years gone by, and when, since I've been here, we haven't, we've, that's probably been our our struggle um, to score goals so it's nice to to come on to come on the pitch especially with fans back in and score some goals um, and then the performances to go with it I mean we're putting putting the hard yards in on the training pitch so to come here and and do it on a Saturday just shows that um, we're all doing something right and a couple of assists for yourself and a, a goal to boot as well how do you feel personally with a, a bit of pre-season behind you and now only one game to go until the season does kick off yeah, um, I feel pretty good. Um, I think the lads of um, lads in the board have bought into everything that Mike and Buster have brought to the table, um, which always helps. And then, obviously, now with the goal threat that we pose, it's always nice to to have someone to to pass the ball to. And then, obviously, grabbing the goals just uh, another good another good uh, another good Saturday. And you mentioned the the fans before as well. Over 800 in the in stands in total, pretty vocal as well. You could have expected that it was over a thousand crowd the the way that they were going on during the game but I maybe mean, say it last week say it all the time but I mean after obviously a year and a half with no one in the stands how big is it for you having people in there backing you? Yeah it's just nice to have them back in um, obviously when, when we're on the pitch we can't really concentrate too much on them we don't hear them obviously once when the game's in play but obviously you always hear it when there's a chance or when they get we get close to the goal um, you always hear that little uproar and it gives you that tiny little boost in which um, which helps us get over the line. Um, obviously restrictions are still kind of in so once they come down I think we'll have a, a, the, the gist bouncing. And you do have the final game of pre-season of course coming up next Saturday against South Shields and away fixture of course today was the, the last fixture at home but how important would it be in terms of even just your confidence to finish pre-season off unbeaten going into the first game of the season? Yeah, I think the talk before the game in the change room was we have to finish pre-season unbeaten. Um, that's the goal. So we'll, we'll go to South Shields, obviously knowing it's another tough test, but um, everything that's been put in front of us so far, we've, we've dealt with and overcome. So um, I kind of feel like we'll go there in high spirits and hopefully it'll be another good game.